This year, the biggest sporting event in the world is heading to Rio de Janeiro. As Brazil prepares to host the 2016 Summer Olympics, the country is also dealing with some controversy. Here to talk about some of the issues surrounding the upcoming games is Brazilian journalist Giselle Peckelman. Thank you for joining us, Giselle. Thank you very much. It's my pleasure. So, can you tell us how are Brazilians reacting to Rio hosting the Olympics? Well, Brazil has been trying to host Olympics for a while. And they couldn't do it. And not only Brazil is a very special event and chance for the whole South America. Because nobody in South America was able to host the Olympics before. Argentina got really close, but it never happens before. The last time they tried, Brazil was having a really strong economy, but it didn't work. So they gave it to someone else and we, we, we weren't able to host. As I kind of like, I would say Brazilian people, people they're all excited about everything. They're excited to have the Olympics over there? Yes, they are. I mean, it's gonna be a happy thing? Yes. So what about the people that aren't so happy about the Olympics? Well, the reason is, is not they're not happy about the Olympics. The problem is we are facing a huge economy problem in Brazil right now. And some of the money the government put in the Olympics, what everybody's complaining is should it be used for the health system or the educational, for some other, other, or other things Brazil need, needs even more. Because when they got a chance to host the Olympics, Brazil was in a completely different situation than it is right now. And somehow, we still, it's still a third world country. And for a third world country to host two big events like a World, world Cup and Olympics in a matter of like a year, it is a lot. So do you think that they are completely ready for, to host such a big event? Well. I was there to end of December to mid-January, right? So things, w back then, things were a little bit slow. But right now, before I came here to talk to you, I did my due diligence <laughs> and I talked to all my colleagues that do work in sports and they, they're going to be covered in the Olympics. They said, yes, it's almost ready. And there's some, they do have some little details to adjust. Part of the Brazilian culture, it is kind of weird, but especially for the Americans, everything gets ready on the last minute. They postpone everything. So like they did in the World, World Cup as well. They've been doing the same thing with the Olympics. It's, it is almost ready, it's gonna be ready, it's gonna be pretty, everything is gonna work, yes. But I tell you something, you're gonna have the, okay, everything is ready, maybe the day before. Oh, okay, so very last minute. Always, <laughs> in Brazil it's like that. Always very last minute. But, works. Okay. Well, thank you so much for joining us. We My appreciate pleasure. You spending your time with us. Uh, since I am going to the Olympics, they start on August 5th, and you can follow me on Twitter at underscore Cindy Robinson for updated coverage during the Games.